A security guard described as a gentle giant by his family is dead after a drive-by shooting outside of a Chatham shopping plaza. WGN's Jewel Hillary live for us at police headquarters with more Jewel. Hi, Ben and Lourdes, 29 year old Sydney Cassell leaves behind a large family, including his parents and several siblings. We talked to them earlier today and they say they can't think of any enemies who would want to hurt him. He was like the life of the party, man. Wherever he had, he trying to make somebody laugh. Joseph Cassell is talking about his 29 year old son, Sydney Cassell, who worked as a security guard at the kids footlocker at 87th and Cottage Grove. The store is closed Friday afternoon after Cassell was shot multiple times in the parking lot Thursday night around 730. I don't understand. Our victims in the Viva security guard here at the uh, uh, Foot Locker. Joseph says investigators told him his son was getting into his van when he was targeted by four people who got out of a blue sedan and shot him in the face, chest and legs. Sydney later died at the University of Chicago Hospital. They hopped back in the car and they left. And some ladies trying to, you know, uh, trying to help him get on CPR. Moments later, Joseph says shots were fired again. Another car came and started shooting. And, you know, the lady them took cover, you know what I'm saying, ran and I guess full locker. Family say Sydney was a 6'5 life of the party. Along with enjoying interacting with kids on his job, he enjoyed fashion. But most importantly, he cared deeply for his family. He was crazy about his family, you know what I'm saying? He was mostly family oriented. We did reach out to Foot Locker and heard back from them not that long ago. They say they are devastated to hear about Sydney's death and that they are providing support for team members. Also, I reached out to CPD not that long ago, and they say that they still don't have any offenders in custody. Area 2 detectives continue to investigate. Reporting live from 35th in Michigan, I'm Jewel Hillary, WGN News.